hello guys welcome to our youtube channel and happy new year to you all guys today's video we're going to show you how we prepared our escovish fish we had it with bami and it was absolutely amazing now from the night before we basically put our bami to salt into some milk and we're just going to put it into the fridge and then the following morning of course which is today we went ahead and prepared our fish and our bami and we had it with plant it was absolutely amazing so what we're doing here is adding a little bit of salt and we're also going to put in a little bit of cinnamon powder now the video is not related to the bami as so so therefore uh, we're just gonna cut right to the chase stay tuned and thank you for watching in advance So we have some lovely goat fish that has been nicely cleaned up already by my mom and uh, we basically season it up with a bit of salt, black pepper and of course some all-purpose seasoning. You can basically use whatever powder seasoning that you preferred. We also have our pickles here which is our bell peppers, our onions, carrots, our pimento berries and scotch bonnet. Guys, if you do not want to add any bell peppers or any of the other type of seasoning that we have here, it's totally up to you. Some people basically just use some some carrots and onions some people use basically everything that is here so moving on we have some garlic cloves in our pot the oil is ready so we're just going to go in and we are going to fry these fishes okay and once uh, the first batch is fried then we are going to remove and then we will basically fry the remaining So we're being very gentle with our fishes here because we realize you're actually really soft and we don't want them to get all squashed out. Once fried right here, we're just going to remove them and then we'll put the other remaining fishes in the pot to fry. So now that we have our fishes all fried to perfection, we are going to go right ahead and prepare our pickles. Now it is the same oil that we use to fry our fish that we are going to use um, to prepare our pickles because it basically has all the flavor from frying the fish. So we don't want to miss out on that. So we're throwing in everything here in the pot which is our pimento berries, bell peppers, onions, scotch bonnet peppers and you name it and we are going to give everything a stir around so all the flavors infuse and incorporate very nicely for our fried fish. We are going to also add a little bit of salt uh, to taste so basically remember to taste your pot as you go along just to see what it needs um, or what it doesn't need and then of course we're going to add a little bit of black pepper as well and most importantly we are going to throw in a little bit of vinegar as well because the vinegar gives the buzz of our escovige fish so please stay tuned So we're just checking in back on our pickles which you can see is um, basically coming on very well the flavor is already kicking usually after you prepare your pickles you basically pour it all over your fish which you will see um, that's what we're going to do and you will cover it and you will leave it so that all the flavor soaked right in and uh, just 
create the whole entire um magnificent <laughs> aroma and uh and basically flavor to your fish itself uh you can have your escovish fish with family plantain bread um it's the most commonly known as well and also if you're going to do a bami don't think that you have to just eat, uh, you know have it with escovish fish it's just something that we fell for today you can have steam fish it's totally up to you do not forget to follow us as well over on instagram at joan homemade meals where we post pictures and videos from time to time and um in case we don't post anything here basically we're actively using instagram just as an fyi so yeah just pouring in all the pickles here um in a separate uh pot and uh we're just going to cover it a little bit after we uh, complete this process and then we will fry our bami quickly frying in our bami into some of our fish oil because we had put some aside as well the same as we had set some aside for our pickles so that our bami also have all of that wonderful flavor of the fish it was absolutely amazing we thoroughly enjoy this so if you want to give this a try please go ahead and do so fried plantain escovish fish and fried bami if you enjoy this video please leave us a thumbs up and you can leave your comments share with your friends and your family and thank Thank you so much for watching and once again happy 2024